you know, as much as I love the brilliant acting, the talented singing, and mm, that oh so luscious chocolate goodness of Miss Taraji P. Henson, I just got to say after what I just read online, Taraji, what the f I mean, I mean, and I'm not even upset that she is supporting Jesse Sm Sm Smollett, or as I like to call him by Dave Chappelle's name, Juicy Smollett. I'm not even upset about that. I mean, that was her co-star on Empire. Yeah, she played uh, her his mama on there. I'm sure they got a good relationship. I mean, and who she chooses to support, whether we like it or not, it's her business. But for crying out loud, to compare his plight to Emmett Till, I'm sorry, I find that personally insulting. Emmett Till was the black kid that was beat to death for allegedly whistling at a white woman and and not one person that assaulted Emmett Till went to jail for his murder. Even so far, even the woman who decades later admitted that she lied on Emmett Till did not suffer one thing, did not serve one day in jail. But she's going to compare the plight to um, Jesse Smollett. Here's the difference. Jesse Smollett's alive. Emmett Till wasn't alive. He died at a young age. Plus, here's another difference. Emmett Till, aside from allegedly whistling at a white woman, which, yeah, technically it's not against the law and we have no evidence that he even did it. But on top of that, He didn't bring any of what happened to him. He didn't deserve what happened to him. Jesse Smollett, on the other hand, he brought all this on himself. Emmett Till did not ask for his fate. Jesse Smollett did. And as far as him, the punishment not fitting the crime, oh, no one got hurt and stuff. But yeah, he could have caused someone to get hurt. And on, and on top of that, in my personal opinion, he's getting five months. You'd have thought the man was getting 50 years. He's getting five months. His career is ruined, she says. Such and such is ruined for Jesse Smollett. Well, whose fault is that, Taraji? Whose fault is that? That's not nobody's fault. That's not the police's fault. That's not... Black folks' fault. That's not even white folks' fault. That's his fault, honey. But to compare him to Emmett Till, and I'll leave a link in the down in the comment section to the article where I read it from. I don't know. That's just insulting. Save that kind of pity for the Trayvon Martins, the George Floyds, the Breonna Taylors, um, the the Ahmaud Arbery's of this country save that sympathy for them not for this guy i know it's your friend but i'm sorry to quote the late great bernie mac from the film soul men let him get his whooping go no, let him get his whooping so nah honey love you to the sky we'll still watch your shows a bit and movies and stuff but this one you take a major L on this. Anyway, I'm out.